everyone, this is David from goldstartool.com and uh, we just received our flat dial. Um, we, we've been out of them for a while and then we just got them in. They're a little bit larger. I'm gonna go over these flat press dies and um, the machine and our, what are they used for? So, as you know, the, our most uh, common item on our website, goldstartool.com, is our gold star uh, grommet press machine, which comes about 1,000 different types of dies. And this happens to be one of them, um, three inch diameter, obviously both of them. And I'm gonna tell you what are they using this for. So, whenever you wanna press stamp or you wanna do a cutout, a lot of people buy dies that will make dies, cut out dies that could totally cut a piece out. What people do is that they use this um, dies and uh, they make it as a pressing surface, right? So, but today we had a customer that came in. We have a lot of people that are coming from uh, far and near and they really want to buy our product. So, or dies and bada, we got to go. So I had a great idea and I told them what you could do, see? There are a lot of people, a lot of companies that have their own special snap button cover. They make it, I don't know where. And these are the part of the snaps, part of the button cover or the button piece of the snaps. And you have to go and make a very expensive die for these special items. The other three parts, although there are different size, we have dies for them, meaning that whoever designed this, designed this cover and then the other side are totally different sizes, which we have the dies for them in our warehouse and we are on the showroom. But for something like that, you have to spend about three to four, maybe $500 for somebody to make an exact die with a cutout so you could put this in and put the button. So we had a customer that came and said, hey, I need to make a die. I said, no, you don't. You know, it would be very expensive with a small run, four or 500 pieces or even maybe less than that. It's not worth it to go out there and make a die for this machine. I mean, it's worth it if you're doing many, many thousand, but not for this small amount. And you could still save a lot of money with something like this. So, Usually, this is the way this works, that you put something in the middle, whatever it is, and just press it down. Could be a small cutout piece, cutout die, to cut a piece of leather or a stamp on a piece of leather, whatever it is, you could just put it, bam, press. Okay, now, we're not gonna lose the, we're not gonna use the upper part. We're gonna go with the bottom part. Just go ahead and tie it. Right? What happened is that this part goes with this, this way. So we have a die for that already in our system and already attached to it, right? Just put it on top. And this one goes on the bottom. I could come closer if you want. I have a piece of fabric and you could always make a line here so you know exactly this has where exactly this has to sit down because there is no die that this could sit in that you know where this should could come down. What I do is I'm gonna make a hole. Right, I'm gonna make a hole. I'm doing it right now. 
and I put this one inside that hole so I could see the other side. I'm just gonna put this in the middle and I'm gonna come just down. Now again, for the first time when you're doing this, you gotta know exactly where this is going, right? And I did this already. Voila, nothing, nothing happened to the back, and this is the part, right? See that? And then, let me do another one. All you have to do is again, I'm, I'm using a scissor, but we have aisle, we have uh, aisles that you could make a hole. I'm gonna make another one. I just go make a hole in here, and the only reason that I make a hole is because I wanna see the other side where it's coming from. I'm gonna do this round one here. Take this one, pull it out. Come from the other side. See this one? Now, this is the part that goes in there. The part that goes in there, all the way up. Sits in there. You bring this down again. And you come down. My glasses, where are you? This one didn't catch because I wasn't in the right place. But it's okay. See, I, I wanted to see where it went. It went to the side. We wanted to go right in the middle. So I'm gonna take this another one out. Out. I'm gonna put this back in there. So what I'm trying to say is that you could use this press machine or the die, flat die press for a variety of items that we don't have die for. So you don't wanna go out there and buy the die. Just it's me, I might. Eyes are not. Okay, now, when you do this part, the other part is very easy. You have this one goes in the bottom. We're gonna change the die. This part goes on the top. Again, I have everything else. I have all the die for whatever you need. This one sits in here. I already have loaded the upper die in there. Even without any holes, good. Again. Maybe it needs a hole. I put a hole just in case. Yeah, it was a little bit thick. Here, all right. So, I'm gonna just put it through. See, it's good that I said many, many times, the first time that I started making a video and something go, would go wrong, I wanted to redo it, but somebody told me that never redo stuff. Let people know that things could go wrong, and it's okay, because it's always, everything is perfect, you're gonna say, oh my God, what, what happened? So this one goes in there, right? So here's the other end. This is this part and see, that's it. Part goes in here. Obviously, I have done this before, but I just, I have many videos on this one, but the idea was to show you the the idea was to show you guys the, the flat press die that you could use it for many, many things. But while we are at it, I just wanna show you how this thing works too. So, great idea for any type of pressing that you need to do, just go ahead and use our die press. It's, it's, it's great, it works with everything everything that is flat, everything that doesn't need to sit somewhere, 
this is a great idea. It's three inch, it works by the way with both our, um, works with our hand press, foot press or kick press, with you know all the system that we have. Another great product from Gold Star Tool, we have them in stock, and go buy them and make beautiful, beautiful stuff. Thank you for watching and this is David from goldstartool.com. Thank you for watching.